don't believe I'm about to take one of these. Hey guys, so we are about to go to the park. We're on base right now. Um, Blake had to run in and pick up an ID. And we're just sitting out here in the car. Um, it's been really nice out. It's been like 70 the past two days. So we took Kane into the park here um, yesterday evening. And then we decided to come again today. So pretty excited because we all get to get out of the house, get some sunshine. <coughs> And he's ready to be out of his car seat. I don't blame him. So it is four o'clock and I'm still waiting on Blake to get out. So I'm just sitting here thinking about how uncomfortable I am. Hello, like dashboard and I'm not even tall. Like I'm 5'4". I'm just like average in literally everything in life. So I'm a very, you know, not tall person and this is just ridiculous and I just really really want a new car not even a new car like just like a different car I just want something bigger and honestly I'd prefer something a little bit older because cars are just crazy nowadays but this is ridiculous like we have no space in this car whatsoever like and I know it'll be better whenever he's forward facing, but I'm not putting him forward facing for a really long time, like like well after two, and um, just to make sure like he's the right weight and height and age and everything. So that's like a really, really long time to be super uncomfortable, but I don't know, like I don't even know what kind of car I would want because I need something bigger and I haven't really drove anything bigger other than a 4Runner. Um, and I drove a Terrain, because Blake's grandma has one. Um, I liked the 4Runner, didn't really care for the Terrain. Ter Am I saying that weird Terrain? Terrain? I didn't really care for that one, but I really, really liked the 4Runner. They're so expensive, oh my gosh. I just can't imagine spending $700 on a car payment a month. That's just ridiculous. Like that, that was my apartment rent whenever I first moved to Georgia. So no thank you. <laughs> um so drop a comment please. Help a girl out. Tell me what kind of um SUVs, minivans, trucks, I don't care. I will rock a minivan. I will figure out how to drive a truck. Just tell me something that fits a Greco giant ass car seat um, rear facing because I need help. <laughs> this is just, I am so claustrophobic right now. Good morning. So me and Kanan are on our way to Target. Well, I need to stop and get gas first, but then we're gonna go to Target and I'm gonna get some little like DIY activities for him because he's been super bored lately indoors and he's kind of over all of his toys right now. So, um, I always like pack them up and kind of put them in the closet and just store them away because um, eventually I'm just going to donate them but I'm waiting till it's a little bit warmer outside um, to go take them to the donation places um, and just to make sure it's not going to like rain that week or whatever. Um, so we're going to go there and try to figure out some little activities that I found on Pinterest and hopefully he'll be into one of them. Um, and I have to get eggs and coffee creamer because I've already used up half of my carton of eggs and I need those for um, cooking for Thanksgiving. It's 11 o'clock and I have not had any coffee yet and I was up till 3 in the morning with him so it's been rough but we're gonna get through it. It's all good. I'm gonna go to Starbucks and walk around Target and get what I need and chug some more coffee as soon as I get home. Alright so me and Kanan just got back from Target and um, he's in the kitchen playing with one of his little projects that I got for him and he's watching Boss Baby. So I figured I'd show you guys the other couple things that I found for him. So I got this in the dollar section and it was $3 and it's just a little felt kit and it comes with a bag, a little felt bug, butterfly, um, ooh, that's a magnifying glass, a little snake, a compass, and a net and some tweezers, there's a little paw print, and um, 
I just thought this would be really fun for him to play with since it is all felt. I know that like it's not going to harm him if he's chewing on it or whatnot. Um, there's a better look at everything. So I thought that would be a cute little activity for him to kind of do. Keep him busy. And then like I said, I was getting the pipe cleaners. And um, I got this big pack of them. And this isn't even all of them because I already have them in the colander. I just got a plastic one from there. I think it was $2 and some change. He's playing with that right now. Kanan! Never mind, he just came running in here. Come here, bud. Come here. Where did you find that? Whoa! He hasn't seen this stuff yet. And then I got him this board. And on one side you can color with crayon and then it um, comes off and then this side is like a finger paint but there's no mess to it so that's why I got this one for that side specifically. Hey buddy. Kanan, can you say hi? Say hi. Oh my goodness. Oh yeah, what's that? You wanna play with it? Okay, let's go in the playroom. <clears throat> Come on. Come on. So this is the little colander that I got. And I've just been sticking them in there for him and he's just been playing around with them. Okay, so we ordered Kenan a new mattress and it is a memory foam one. This is not how I was expecting it to come. So, let's see. I guess that's the print of it. And then I also got another. Okay, so this is my plant hanger. That is the company. And it's just a long macrame plant hanger. This is for my fern in the bathroom. Let's go check it out. Come on, baby. I'm hoping it's not too long. Just to wear like it doesn't dip in the bath water. <laughs> we'll see. Looks good. Now I have a lot of leaves to clean up.
really weird kind of gap in between this weekly vlog and it's also going to be put up late so I'm going to try to get it put up today. Today's Tuesday um, but I had family over for Thanksgiving. My mom came, her boyfriend came and the dinner took way longer than expected <laughs> because it's my first year cooking a turkey. It turned out freaking amazing though so I'm not mad about it and my sister was running kind of behind also so it all worked out but like I had no time. I didn't even get a picture of Kanan in his original outfit, so we had to take like makeup pictures later in the day, like my shirt was wrinkled at that point, like my hair was frizzy just from like, you know, sweating, running around, cooking, and <laughs> it was, it was a whole mess. So, um, <laughs> it was a really good Thanksgiving, but it was just like an unplugged Thanksgiving, and I'm really sorry about how chapped my lips are. Like, I feel like they're breaking in half every single time. I talk so that sucks but I wanted to show you guys real quick the bathroom progress because I did finish a lot of things so I got my fern hung up which you all saw and that's what the harder looks like in there um, I think I told you guys that I wasn't able to obviously paint the shower um, door but I got to do the rest of it and then um, I had to re have this whole repatched because it still just was a little bit noticeable so I just have to paint that today but we got our hooks hung up for our towels and I'm really loving how that looks I don't know I just think that looks so cute and minimal so I'm going to show you guys the guest bathroom really quick and I have to be super quiet because Kanan is asleep on the couch he fell asleep while I was like mid folding laundry and I'm not mad about it because now I have an excuse to take a break from the laundry <laughs> And again, we had to buy new putty to redo the holes, and so today we just have to sand these and paint this. But I love, love, love how it looks. And how cute are my leggings today. Feeling very festive. And I got our tree hung up. Um, I think it was, it was Sunday, so today's Tuesday, I got that hung up, hung up, oh my gosh, I got that put up Sunday, and I don't have a lot of ornaments that I put on there, but this is kind of like, I guess, the tree theme. And then I have our one from last year, which was our first Christmas. Um, this one my mother-in-law got for Kanan, and then a similar one that Lake's grandma got for him. I love my tree so much. This little guy's here because it needed some sunshine. Oh, and I finally posted... So I finally posted my table for sale on the... Oh my god, there's fingerprint. Sorry about that. <laughs> so I finally posted my kitchen table set for sale on Marketplace. And I'm really, really hoping somebody will buy it for Christmas because I have another one on my um, Amazon list. And it's really kind of an original thought. It's an indoor-outdoor table. All the reviews I've seen, people put it outside. But I just love the way it looks. So I'm like, I'm buying that for in here. Super cheap. It's like $124.00 and it's a six seater table. Um, and then I also got six chairs on my list and those are, I think those are like 140, but free shipping and prime. Uh oh. Good morning. That was not a long enough nap. <laughs> this is my laundry situation and that's only one of the three loads. So Kanan was definitely not ready to wake up. And somebody please help me. How did you wean 
your kids from breastfeeding because oh my gosh my boobs hurt so bad <laughs> I'm just gonna say it they just hurt so bad and I think that's why my lips have been so dry these past like two three weeks like I know I'm not getting enough water and especially if I don't have my water sitting by me then I'm just like going to be dehydrated because you're supposed to drink like a whole thing of water like while you're feeding them but oh my gosh that's just not possible sometimes and I'm trying to get all this laundry put up and folded and it's just not working But anyways, I'm craving a freaking pizza so bad. <laughs> but I want like a huge like New York style pizza, like a good one with like big fluffy crust. And I really want a Coke. Which is kind of weird because I've been on a Dr. Pepper like binge lately. But I really want a Coke. I've been craving just weird stuff lately. I might take a pregnancy test. Though I highly doubt that I could be pregnant on my birth control. But stranger things have happened in the world. Either that or it's just like breastfeeding so much just makes me hungry. <laughs> like sometimes I think that breastfeeding cravings are way, way worse. Like more intense than pregnancy cravings. I think it's because with pregnancy cravings, you can usually just get up and go get whatever you want or have anybody, like, will just go get you whatever you want. I'm like, I'm stuck here with freaking huge baby on my lap. Not even a little tiny baby. I used to just, like, walk around, cook a meal with him on my arm. But now I'm like, no, I can't carry him around. Just one-handed. He's 20 pounds. So that's not going to work. And I need to start editing the rest of this video, but I'm stuck. Mmm. <laughs> crazy. Crazy, crazy. Hey, princess. Hi, princess. Okay, bye. I'm so excited. Kanan's big Christmas present just caught you here. Wasn't expecting it till the 4th. That's whenever my mom said it'd be delivered. My mom got him a kitchen and it is so freaking cute. Can't wait to put it together to show you guys. Um, probably gonna have to wait to put it together just because I will get too excited and I'll give it to him early and we still have a month. So, it's gonna stay in this box. But it's a huge, huge box. I'm excited! I can't wait for him to see us and play with it. He's going to absolutely love it. He's obsessed with the kitchen. He's obsessed with dishes. So he's going to love having all this stuff to just open and bang around and play with. I'm really, really, really excited for this Christmas. I don't believe I'm about to take one of these. I didn't think I was going to have to do this for like two more years, but I guess we'll see. Um, this is the Family Dollar brand. It's like compared to first response, I think. So I am going to end this vlog here, and you guys will just have to wait till next week to see. Okay, love you, bye.